moments in history, 152. Missouri Compromise, Rufus King. Everything seemed peaceful to the Republican administration of Monroe, the fifth held by the Virginia dynasty of Jefferson, Madison, and Monroe. Until the suggestion was made that slavery be barred from the proposed state of Missouri. Instantly, pandemonium broke loose. Finally, a compromise, which it was hoped would settle the slavery question for all time, was agreed on in 1820. Missouri should come in without restrictions, but henceforth slavery would be prohibited north of Missouri's southern border. In the rest of the Louisiana Purchase, on the same time Maine was admitted, which helped satisfy the North. Rufus King, one of the recognized leaders of the Federalist Party, was an outstanding figure in the Senate debates on the Compromise, supporting the anti-slavery side of the argument. 